two this morning, a vote by tens of thousands of UC workers to go on strike. Today in the Bay's Bob Riddell live for us this morning. And Bob, with the finals approaching on most of those campuses, uh, talk to us about what this could mean for those students. Well, Marcus and Laura, if these workers do go on strike mid-November, this could cause a problem for college students taking their final music, uh, exams at UC campuses. Last night, the UAW union that represents 48,000 researchers, teachers, assistants, and graders at UC campuses and UC-run labs, uh, they voted overwhelmingly to authorize a strike. In a tweet, the union wrote that the UC system must, quote, create uh, cease unlawful conduct and negotiate in good faith to create research and teaching environments where all can thrive. Now, the Chronicle reports that the main sticking point is compensation. For example, the paper spoke to a researcher who is paid for just 20 hours of work a week, even though it takes him 40 hours to get the job done right. A UC spokesperson tells the Chronicle that the university is offering, quote, fair pay and good health benefits in a supportive and respectful work environment. The workers could go on strike as soon as November 14th. UC Berkeley tells the paper a strike around finals would be a challenge, but expects other faculty could step in to help undergrads and grade their work. Reporting live, Bob Riddell, Today in the Bay.